what's up hey I gotta get a burn box built well I gotta get the whole barrel smoker built and I'm gonna start with the burn box on it I don't know why I usually go the opposite do the barrel first or the pit first and then the burn box but I'm gonna start with the burn box and get it knocked out and uh then start on the barrel smoker and I'm doing this in a two-part thing because I know the video is gonna get long and uh so I'm just doing a video of the burn box then a video of putting it all together on the smoker just to keep it from being too long so y'all stick around and see what we got going on All right, y'all, quick catch up from last night. I looked back and I realized it had gotten pretty dark and you couldn't even hardly see what I was doing when I was cutting those out. There's one on each side. And I, I looked again and I thought I had uh, film cutting these out, but I had hit that stutter shot or whatever it is on there and it took like 200 pictures of it instead of filming it. But anyway, these are just side vents. They're going there just to add extra air on there in there. And there's a vent on the on the front of the door too. I think I showed some of that. But anyway, I went ahead. I had cut the uh, pieces for the basket too. So I'm gonna go ahead and start putting that basket together, and then we'll get the door put on.
So I went ahead and finished the thing up. Got the handle put on and uh, the uh, little latch on it. I think the last thing I showed was putting the hinges on. And I was trying to do a different type of handle, one of the twist handles where you twist it and it locks it. You twist it the other way and it unlocks it. But I just didn't have the right stuff to sleeve it with. The dial pin going through it. And it just, I couldn't get it right. It was too sloppy fitting. So I ended up putting a regular handle. So this is what we got. It's a 16, if I remember. I think it's 16 by 16 and 5 eighths. That's almost 16 and a quarter. That's with the sides. 16 and 16 and three quarters. It's almost a box <laughs> or a square. But uh, everything came out pretty decent on it. These were the side vents. This is just extra air if you want it. You know, you ain't got to have them open. You can just close them off and leave them closed. However you want to do it. I put a latch on there to hold it, just a regular handle with a spring in it. I haven't cut the hole in the back yet where it's gonna connect because I gotta I'm gonna do the uh, I'm gonna do the pit first and make sure where I'm connecting everything. But everything came out looking real good on it. It almost I almost think it's a little bit too big. I think it'll be fine on that barrel. So anyway, man, that'll do it on this one. If you like these videos, uh, please like and subscribe. Come back for the next one. The next one is probably that barrel that this is going to connect to. I just, the only reason I did it in two parts is because I knew the video was going to be kind of long. So I figured I'd do two parts to it. So that'll do it on that. Come back and see what's going on next, man. Please like and subscribe. See you then.